Today we're at Ely Cathedral in Cambridgeshire, England, and we're with Mark Bonney, the Dean of the Cathedral. Um, he's got a beautiful, beautiful place here, beautiful octagonal shapes uh, around the altar. Um, Mark, um, I wonder if you can talk a little bit about what's so special about Ely Cathedral. What, what makes it unique among English cathedrals? Well, the octagon that you mentioned is one of its unique ar architectural features, and it's one of the medieval cathedrals from dating back to the 11th and 12th centuries. And here we are in the Lady Chapel of Ely Cathedral. It's the largest Lady Chapel of any medieval cathedral in England, and it's a very special place. It's one of its unique features. Yeah, as well. it's, it's breathtaking. And in the in this room, there are um, costumes from all the various uh, television shows and films that are, are are made here in the cathedral. Yes, we've got doing this sort of platinum jubilee year of the, the Queen's jubilee. Um, we've got this what we call it crowns and gowns. So it, it is uh, costumes that have been. Uh, been part of the several films that have been made here over the past 15, 20 years, I suppose. Now, one of the interesting things for me, too, is just seeing how you were producing your own content, video content. I wonder if you can talk a little bit about how um, you live stream things and uh, how you've, wh how's that changed your preaching or, or your approach to ministry? We started live streaming because of COVID. And we, we had a period where we weren't allowed in the church at all. And then we, when we could come in, we could only live stream services. And then that built up quite a sort of a, an online congregation. So we've carried on doing that. I, I must admit, I forget that it's happening now. You know, we, we, we've got a following of four or 500 people, I think, you know, view each one. Yeah, yeah. Um, whether it's changed how I preach or not, I'm not sure. <laughs> Well, when we first went online, we they, they gave us very, I mean, it was me in the cathedral by myself yeah. and robot yeah. cameras. And they said, you always got to start with this one, then you've got to go back. Yeah. And, and then, you know, when people came back, it, it, I do keep it shorter than I did yes, before. I, think, I mean, I've never been a long preacher. And we've got some really good people who are trained up to do it. So that, and they've we have three, two, three or four cameras, and they're always moving the shots around. So that's, and I think it works, it works very well. Yeah, yeah. I, I, um, I, there's so much that's beautiful in th this um, place. Uh, you have the, the oak, this massive oak table. Um, it, there, there are also, uh, at the last, some of the cathedrals we've been see seeing, there's been a really strong kind of environmental movement that's been part of the cathedral life. And I, I don't know if that's something that, that you see here at Erie. Yes, we do. We, we have, we have a, a non-stipendary minister who we call our Minister for Social Justice. And the uh, sort of climate change brief is very much what she's been doing. And we are actually coming up, our program of things doing this autumn is very much focusing on uh, climate change and those sorts of issues. Um, we had a big cathedrals conference nationally a couple of weeks ago. And actually one of the best talks given by that was somebody who's a member of the congregation here who's oh, an engineering great. professor in Cambridge. Wow. And he's big into that. Um, it's a real challenge. And I mean, the Church of England has, is, uh, committed to getting to net zero by 2030. I think mm. that uh, yeah. may well be a step too far, but it's a route we're challenge we're working to. Um, it'll be more about how can we keep people warm, get people warm in this place rather than get the building warm. Right, <laughs> right, I mean, exactly. It'll be, be blankets and heaters and not uh, for people, not for trying to get the building warm. Right, blankets I think are the future for cathedrals. <laughs> <afraid> so. <laughs> well, it's so kind of you to take yeah. the time to talk to us today and I know that many of the people who are watching back home are going to want to visit this cathedral in, in the future. Well, do come and uh, it's, been, it's been great to meet with you, Malcolm, and uh, every blessing to you and to the people at Grace. Great. Thanks, Mark. My name is Malcolm Clemens-Young. I'm the Dean of Grace Cathedral in San Francisco. Thanks for watching. More good news.